the forum is a chance for me to meet people from all over the world. We have workshops, a lot of conversations. How could we connect the dots to imagine the future that we want to create? And we have this space to experiment and make good trouble with one another. Whether you've got finance people, people that influence the political landscapes, or whether you've got practitioners, that shared recognition of the scale of the challenge that we're facing is now more universal than it's ever been. That passion and almost sense of family comes through. There's a really strong sense of personalized hospitality that puts everyone at ease. Bringing people together on a kind of very high level of conversation is possible without egos. It doesn't matter where you're from or how much resources you have, we're all hitting the same barriers. And there's a magic in knowing that you're not alone in that. We need to practice the future. And so I think the built environment disciplines are really interesting because we produce things that are tangible. We imagine what nature will do over time. So from this half desert, a former industrial wasteland, we've made this Mediterranean climate, lowering perceived temperature 20 degrees. We have enough of these buildings that can show that it is possible to build a building that gives back more than it takes away. This has to be the way we build in the future. It's made me think differently about the local. Absolutely, we need to build local, but how do you also find somewhere in that narrative a celebration of um, interdependence? You're in a setting of care amongst peers. There are no speakers, there is no audience. There is just an invitation for a conversation with some radical honesty on that side. And then you can't forget the amazing natural setting, right? Being up in the landscape creates a really special environment for different sorts of conversations. I've made really strong career connections and also friendships. I think we're going to see a lot of collaborations. 